So first things first, you're gonna to wanna to load up ESPN's website. Just go to ESPN.com. Now one thing to note before we hop into is this will only be available via the website. A lot of these settings are not gonna be available via the ESPN app. You can't do this on mobile, you'll just have to go to the website. So once you load the app, you're gonna to go to this profile in the bottom left corner. Um, where it says log out. It's going to say log in for you. You're going to log into your account right there. Once you've logged in, you're going to click on fantasy right here. You're going to see all of your different leagues right here on the right side of your screen. For this example, I'm going to be showing you guys this league right here. Um, you're going to want to go to the team settings right here. A couple things you can change right here. Your team logo, your team name, or abbreviation for things like that. But um, the majority of the settings are going to be available to be changed up here where it says LM tools. Now this will only appear if you are the league owner or league manager of the league. And from this page, there's going to be a lot of things you can change edit the league managers right here if you'd like to invite different managers to your teams you can do that right there if you like to add teams to your league delete teams from your league if you like to assign certain teams uh, league managerial powers you can do that right here edit the roster settings if you would like to um, edit maybe the number of quarterbacks or different things in your league you can do that from this page right here roster moves you can adjust the rosters in your league trade review um, if you would like to review certain trades that happen in your league you can do that automatically right there um, edit the draft settings if you're looking to change your draft type to a uh, a snake auto pick or if you're looking to do an offline draft which means your league is going to draft outside of this you can change it to that right there yeah input offline draft results you can do that right here if you have done your drafts offline if you look to edit the draft order right here same thing you can just click edit and you can drag teams to whatever order you would like them to draft from but moving on here you can edit the uh, schedule settings if you're looking to edit how many uh, weeks are in the season or how the playoffs work you can do that uh, by that page, edit head-to-head -head matchups. If you'd like to play a certain team a certain week, this is where you're gonna be able to edit that those settings right there. Edit league settings right here. There's gonna be just a general list. If you cannot find what you're looking for, edit for editing right here, I recommend looking on this list right here. Moving on to edit score settings, edit the scoring in your league, edit teams and divisions. If you like to edit the divisions in your league, maybe you want an AFC or an NFC, delete your league, adjust the scoring, adjust how scoring works right there. But yeah, that's pretty much it. If you guys have any questions or anything I did not cover about the advanced saves with the ESPN Fantasy, let me know in the comment section below and I'll be more than happy to answer any questions you guys may have. But yeah, if you guys could subscribe, that would be awesome so I can keep making content just like this for you guys. See you guys in the next video.